So let's talk to you all real quick. So let's talk why you can see the vibrancy in things when you connect with other cosmic beings to defeat the D-Room alien matrix, right? So when we look at the matrix, we see it, we cosmic beings see it as terror, complete hell, tragic. That's what we that's what we cosmic beings see the matrix as that's designed by these D-Room alien matrix that broke universal laws. That we sofa beings created to keep our cosmos like very, very clean. So me, when I connect with other cosmo beings, right? I literally merge my power with their powers and we just be shining bright. We be lighting up everything, man. You know what I'm saying? Like we are limitless beings when we are together, right? So it's like, man, me every single day, when I ascend to a next level within the Unimons, Unihearts, and Unisouls, I'm, I'm always connected with other Cosmo beings, regardless of their ET alien life form race. Because all the soulful ETs are all over the universes, from Universe 1 to Universe 2, all of that. Angel numbers are numbers that you see to go to all these different universes and stuff like that. I've been in Universe 444, I've been in Universe 555. Connecting all these cosmo beings that gravitate to me, you know, because they're on the same journey as me to defeat these Deerum alien slave owners. And seeing the vibrancy in things, you know, vibrancy in the journey, you know, the 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 great the great fortune of this all is the Deerum alien matrix is gonna be defeated before the 22nd century occurs. Like there's not gonna be no more religion, no more politics, no none of that, yo. It's gonna be none of that stuff. So that's real deep jewels, crystallized metamorphous talk for the mind, heart, and soul. You know, it's pretty. It's so many things that I can say, I can express. But you know, other cosmo beings from within my ET or they feel the same thing, even if they know, even if they don't know how to put it into exact words to explain what it might be, what it is. You know what I'm saying? But. In the end, the Demon Room Alien Matrix that's ran by these narcissistic, soulless, arsticive, toxic Demon Room Aliens, they're, go they're gonna be gone. They're gonna be defeated because their time is running up. All these Demon Room Alien slave owners that always wanna post block people from posting the truth of questioning the Matrix, sharing their talent and stuff like that, it shows that, you know, they are falling apart, right? So... We cosmic beings, we are the X factor, right? We're the X factor. We are definitely the X factor. Because we got the solar power. We got all kinetic powers. We soulful beings. Ready you a Palladium, a Architon, a Namo, a Feline. Regardless of what your alien ET species might be, from whatever universe you originated from. All soulful beings are aligned with each other from within. You know what I'm saying? Because all the kinetic powers that we soulful beings have, when we team up together, these D-Room aliens can't do nothing. They're going to be defeated in the 21st century. There won't be no form of indoctrination. No more forms of toxic, toxic residues harming our universes. None of that. You know what I'm saying? You heard it here from me first. And a lot of other cosmic beings, you know, we're striving to build a lot of abundance of great fortune and great freedom to defeat these D-Room aliens. To end this soulless natures that keep occurring and on and on and on and on and on. For like for, for, for like a long period of time. All those years that those D-Room aliens have been plotting to gain control over masses and try to like indoctrinate to not question nothing and just slave away and just let the universes crumble. That's just a sign right there that they, those demon room alien slave owners, they got what's coming to them. They got what's coming to them from me. They got what's coming to them from a lot of my Cosmo family on social media. Whether it's from, from this universe, the other universes, the galactic power is here. You can see in my eyes, 
My eyes is filled with so much hurricanes, so much tornadoes, so much ice shards that's ready to just explode on these demon aliens. And a lot of my soul family got powers too. And our, our talents is another form of kinetic power attributes too. That's real deep jewels right there. And y'all can see, I'm looking straight into this camera because I know that those demon room aliens are just watching, hearing, trying to see if anybody catches on. Well, the sofa beings, you know, we're enlightened, we're aware, we're awakened to all their empty vibrational doings. And all those empty vibrational doings is leading to their demise, which is coming real soon. And that soon will definitely happen before the 22nd century occurs so a lot of cosmic beings from all different regions even if they don't live where i am met the cosmo beings are always with me anytime i think i am speaking i am unleashing a lot of war cries a lot of battle cries on the on the front line the middle line the back line of the galactic troops the galactic warriors because we cosmo beings are the ninjas of the cosmos the beyonders all these different infinite universes so all these multiple infinite universes is cleansing itself from all this demon room alien residue and i can tell you for sure we cosmic beings the solar ets of the multiverse and beyond verse realm all of our powers come from the from the from the darkness all from the darkness right the beyond verse realm is like the darkness when you go to the highest 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 levels it's like a world world of void and it shows an authentic light those demon room aliens try to say darkness is evil soulless that's not true where you find jewels at where you find crystals at where you find emeralds at? A cave that's dark. And the jewels are the cosmo beings that shows that authentic light to defeat the artificial light demon room alien slave owners. This stuff is way bigger than, you know, shootings. Way bigger than any type of brutalities that most people hear around on this planet Earth. Because the huge war... The huge warfare that's coming to take place is the demon room aliens versus the cosmo beings. So share this message, spread it as much as you can, because let me tell you something. Us cosmo beings, we can do anything. We are not we are not limit. We are not limited to anything. We are limitless beings. Just like this music that I am playing called Mr. X. Mega Man 6, Mr. X. This music theme represents the Cosmo Beings are always aligned. So, whatever a Cosmo Being in, a, in one universe is, is at, they could be walking somewhere, transporting themselves somewhere. And deep down, deep from within, the mind, heart, and soul, they are not alone. Me, I can go from fucking Texas, I can go from fucking Nebraska, Indiana, New Hampshire, Kenya. Caribbean, St. Lucia, all, all the planets outside Earth, all the universes outside the universes that we live on, that I live on, I am not alone. So, a lot of my Cosmo family is with me. Just like I am always with my Cosmo family from within. And no matter how many centuries that goes on, where it's the 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, beyond centuries... I'm always going to be here. The Cosmo family always going to be here. Anything that is soulful is not going to die out. It's just going to crystallize and transcend. All that soulless, narcissistic, slave owner energies, they're going to die out. They will die out. Because you know why? The Demon Room Alien Slave Owners, let me tell you what, let me tell you something. They are so much of an empty vibrational being. When they do the peace sign, when they do this, 
they represent war, right? They represent destruction when they do this. The soulful beings, when we do this, we represent peace, freedom. And this peace sign that the soulful beings represent, aka the Unk Set Stars. Notice how I say Unk Set Stars because Unk Set Stars is ancestry of the Cosmo Rim. So A N K H C H E S T A R. You got Unk Set Stars instead of ancestor. So you tell me who's gonna win win the war. The Demon Room Aliens or the Soulful Beings? Because this is like a Titan sword when I pair these two together. You notice how this symbol is way more powerful than the separated? Notice how this is way more strength, more potent, more stable. It's like you feel a lot of energy channeled within yourself feeling all the energy of other cosmic ET life forms within you. So me, to make a long video short, I see the vibrancy in this journey, knowing and comprehending that, and I'll repeat, I do not believe because believing is something. Believing is not, it's like not knowing yourself. Might as well start comprehending things, you know what I'm saying? So I comprehend that the D-Room Alien Matrix and all of his slave owners will be gone because it's from the power of the cosmic beings. Peace out.